Welcome back. Welcome back. Hello, guys. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hey. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. How are you today? I'm fine. <laughs> How do you feel today? I feel good. It is Monday. How was your weekend? Mm. How was your weekend? My weekend was very good. What did you do this weekend? Mm. I went to my family oh, okay. uh, to, to the river. To the river, okay. So you river. can say, river. You can yes. say you can say I I went I went to the to river the, with, with my family my family Fam family family I went to the river with my family Excellent Jonathan uh, what river did you visit some pool driver. Ah, okay. Mm, yes, yes. Is um far? Uh, no, cerca. How near? do you say cerca? Mm. It's it's near to me mm. uh, because I from I live in Chalatenango. Ah, okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> All right. Excellent. Did you have a good time? Yes, very time. Very very good time. That's good. I'm happy to hear that and welcome. Thank you. Okay. Welcome everybody. Can everybody hear me? Can you see me? Hello, yes, Myra. Teacher. Hello, Iris. Hello, uh, hello teacher. Welcome. Hello, Thank Carlos. You. Hello, Yancy. Hello. Hello, Christian. Hello, Lisbeth. Hello, Claudia. Hello, Hello, Miguel. Hello, Adriana. Hello, Yancy. Welcome. Welcome, guys. Are you ready for your English class? Yes. Of course. Yes. I'm ready. Yes. Okay. Okay. Do you guys remember something about your previous class? No mucho, la verdad. Hace como un año que, que dejé el pre-intermedio anterior. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. And how long have you has it been since you studied? How long have you studied? About three weeks. Maybe. Three weeks. Oh, that's not a long time. That's um, not a long finish, time. Finish uh, intermediate too. Oh, okay. Okay. That's okay. Excellent. At this moment, uh, what do you think is going to be the agenda for this? pre-intermediate module three. Mm -hmm. um. You don't remember? No. What is the question? Um, for this section, we're going to be looking at it's a very exciting place. It's a very exciting place. We're going to be looking at conversations 
about the city using the where adverbs. Repeat, please. It's a fairly big city. It's fairly big city. It's a fairly big city. It's a very fairly big city. So, have you ever traveled to a big city? Have you ever traveled to a big city? Mm, depend. <laughs> no. <laughs> Do you know any big cities? Yes, when I was a child, I uh, traveled in a big city in Guatemala. Ah, okay. Guatemala City. What is the name of the city? Guatemala City. Guatemala City. Okay. Okay. Can anybody else tell me uh, another city that you are mm. familiar with? Big cities in the El Salvador. Okay. San Salvador. For example, uh -huh. San Salvador. Um, San Miguel, mm -hmm. Santa Ana. Okay, okay. Excellent. Very good, Jonathan. Uh, somebody else that can tell me another big city that you know? Santa Tecla. Okay, Santa Tecla is, it's a, it's not really a big city, but it's a city. Uh, what about um, New York City? Is New York City a big city? Yes. Yes, it is. Yes. What about Houston, Texas? Is that a big city? Yes. 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 I think. yes. Excellent. Dallas, Texas is a big city. Dallas, Texas is a big city, correct. All right. Uh, for this section, what we're going to do is we're going to be looking at a video uh, describing a big city. I would like for everybody to please uh, get out your notebook and your pen so that you can take notes in regards to the pronunciation or the vocabulary or something like that. Are you ready? Ready. Listen, please. About a city where adverbs before adjectives are used. As soon as you listen to it, I want you to play it again and practice the conversation with a friend or a relative. So where are you from, Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow, I've heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is. The weather is great and there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Is it expensive there? No, it's not very expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. Let's listen one more time. Conversation with a friend or a relative. So where are you from, Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow. I've heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is. The weather is great, and there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Is it expensive there? No, it's not very expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. 
Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. All right. I would like for Fantastic us to pages. Just listen and repeat. So, where are you from, Carmen? So, so where, where are you, are you from, are from, from, Carmen. from, Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow. I've heard that's a really nice city. Wow. wow. I've, I've heard, heard that's a really nice, nice city. city. Really nice city. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, is. it is. The weather is great. The weather, the weather is, great. is great. And there are some fantastic beaches. And there, there are some are fantastic, fantastic beaches. beaches. Just outside the city. Just, Just outside, outside the, city. the city. Is it expensive there? Is it expensive, is it there? expensive, there? expensive there? No, it's not no. very expensive. It's no, not very it's expensive. not very expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? How big, How big is the city? The city. It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. It's, it's a fairly big city. It's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. It sounds, it sounds perfect, perfect, to perfect, perfect to me. Maybe I should. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. Maybe, Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. sometime. All right. At this moment, does anybody have any questions in regards to this vocabulary? Um. Yes. Show. Should. Should. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometimes. Tal vez debería planificar un viaje allí una vez. Teacher, at what meaning? Eh, Quiero se me perdió. Fairly, fairly, algo así. Ah, fairly. Fairly, fairly, fairly. It's a fairly big city. Es como fairly, es como que más o menos. Oh, entendí. Mm -hmm. Like, not, no mucho. Eso este... significa no mucho, más o menos. Ajá. Eh, en este caso, si usted dice fairly big city, es como que eh, podemos decir que es a big city, but you know, it's not like, for example, if I say Houston, Texas is a big city. Oh, entiendo. Eh, San Salvador is fairly a big city, but not really, because you can cross San Salvador completely in less than one hour, depending on traffic. So it's fairly a big city. Okay. An another question. Another question? Maybe it's como puede ser o quizás algo así. That's right. Quizás, maybe, tal vez. Weather. Tal vez. Weather. Weather. Where's the weather? The weather is great. El clima. The weather is great. Another question?
not for me. Another question? No more question. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to practice the conversation. We are going to practice the conversation. I'm going to, going to practice it in pairs. Let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. One student can be Eric and one student. Okay, Miguel, you are Eric. And Lisbeth is going to be Carmen. Okay. I sent the conversation to the WhatsApp chat. Okay, so where are you from, Carmen? Can uh, estaba participando? Mayra Patricia. No. Um, okay, yo creo que se desconectó. But I can. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Sí, yo creo que tiene mala conexión okay. porque ya no está. Okay, action. Okay, so where are you from, Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow, I've heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is. The world is great. And there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Is it expensive there? No, it's not very expensive. Prices are very reasonable. How big is the, is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. Maybe I should have plan, plan a trip there something, sometime. That's all. Okay, That's good, it. good work, good work. Good pronunciation, no observations, thank you. Okay, tell me, Patricia, select another student and Miguel, select another student. Uh, okay. Claudia Jocelyn. Claudia Jocelyn. Claudia. Maybe. Christian. Christian. Claudia hello, Jocelyn hello. is Eric. Hello. Christian <coughs> is Carmen. Solo una, una pregunta. Este, para, para ir leyendo eso, lo han, para practicarlo, lo capturaron, ¿verdad? Es que no, eh, no, no, yo no está lo capturé. En el, está en el grupo del WhatsApp. Está en el grupo del WhatsApp. Es que no, no estoy ahí, aún no me han agregado, no me parece nada. Ah, ok. Para agregarse al grupo, tiene que ingresar al correo electrónico eh, donde le mandaron el enlace para la clase. Allí usted va hasta abajo y allí le tiene que decir enlace para grupo WhatsApp. Ok, ahorita verifico eso. Usted le da clic allí y de allí le tiene que dar donde dice incorporarse al grupo. Me teacher, I can. Ok, go ahead. Um, Eric. Yes. So, where are you from, Carmen? I am from San Juan, Puerto Rico. 
Well, I we heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is. The weather is great, and there are some fantastic beach to outside the city. Is it expensive there? No, it's not very expensive. Places are pretty reasonable. Oh, big is the big is the city. It's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. Excellent. Excellent. Perfect. Perfect pronunciation. No observations on that one. Thank you. All right. Let me have a go ahead. Select somebody. Select somebody. Okay. Here we are. Who do you select? Mm, Cesar Alexander. Cesar Alexander is. Good night. Eric. Cesar Alexander. Good evening. You're going to be Eric. And the next person, who else? Another person. Okay. Who else? Who else can participate? Who else can participate? Who? Iris. Iris. Uh -huh. Iris Janet, creo que. Oh, okay. Iris Janet. Okay. Okay. Uh, so where are you from, Carmen? Hola, hello. Hello. Sí. I am I am Carmen. That is correct. Eh, ¿Con quién voy a participar? Perdón. Eh, Claudia. Mm -hmm. César. Oh, okay. With César Alexander. Ah, okay. With César. Okay, que empiece César, entonces y luego continúo. Okay. okay. So, where are you from, Carmen? I am from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow, I have heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is the weather is great and there are some fantastic beach just outside the city. Is it expensive expensive there? No, it's a not very expensive. Price are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too bad, too big. It sounds perfect to me. Maybe I should apply a trip there sometime. Excellent. Very good. All right. It looks like you guys uh, dominate this vocabulary pretty well. At this moment, do you guys have a question related to this? conversation or a question related to the the topic okay so right now what you're going to do is you're going to come over here where it says mostrar oh. discussion oh there's no discussion forum okay 
We're going to look at the next one. This one does have one. Let me see. At the bottom. Okay. So here, what I want you to do is I want you to write a similar conversation related to describing a city. Uh, you're going to go, añade una publicación where it says título. You're going to put describing a city. And here you're going to write a similar conversation to this one. Va a escribir una conversación similar a esta que acabamos de ver in a discussion forum over here. Describing a city that you like. It can be San Salvador. It can be whatever city you like. And you are going to do it with a partner. If you are on your cell phone, you can write the conversation in your notebook. And then after class, you can pass it to the platform. You will have five minutes. Ready, let's go. Ay, teacher, eh, ¿verdad que vamos a hacer una descripción similar a la que acabamos de, de hacer? That is correct. That okay. is correct. La vamos a transcribir. Yes. En nuestro cuaderno. Luego la vamos a tomar imagen y la vamos a poner en el grupo o, o solo la vamos a leer cuando usted le dice. No, no, no. You're going to write it over here. Okay. You're going to write it right here in the discussion box. Right here. Right here. Sí. On this okay. section, right here. 1.3 video. Okay. Okay.
All right, is everybody finished? Is everybody finished? Para ser sincero, teacher, eh, yo no, bueno, el grupo de nosotros no, no comprendió y no, no hayamos que era lo que íbamos a repasar. Oh, okay. I'll, I will explain right now. Okay. Me too, teacher. I don't understand what's hap what happened. Okay, that's okay. I will explain it to you right now. Thanks. Is everybody back? All right, let me have, who was able to finish the activity? Who finished the activity? Did anybody finish the activity? No? No faltaron quizás una par de oraciones, teacher. Okay, okay. ¿Quién era su compañero, César? Mayra. Okay. Eh, podemos escuchar lo que sí completaron juntos. Yes. Okay, okay. Mayra and César. So, where are you from, Mayra? I'm from San Salvador City. Wow, I have heard that's a really nice city. Yes, it is. The world is great and there are some uh, Fantastic malls and excellent restaurants in the city. Is it a cheaper there? Yes, it's very cheap. Price are very reasonable. Reasonable. Hasta ahí nos quedamos, teacher. That's all. Okay, okay, that's good. Uh, repeat after me. Reasonable. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Thank you. Of course. Más? Más? ¿Te lo hizo? Nobody. Okay. Eh, y cómo se escribe? Oh, reasonable is R E. Let me see. Reasonable, reasonable. Es razonable, reasonable. All right, uh, basically what you're going to do, uh, lo que estaban trabajando, era, eh, aquí en la plataforma estábamos viendo esta conversación, eh, donde estaba describiendo el muchacho una ciudad grande. And listen to a conversation about a city where adverbs before adjectives are used. As soon as you listen to it, I want you to play it again and practice the conversation with a friend or a relative. So where are you from? So esta era eh, la, la conversación que estábamos practicando right here. So what you're going to do is come over here where it says section 1.3 adverbs before adjectives y le va a dar click aquí donde dice añade una publicación donde dice título Va a escribir describing a big city 
Y después aquí iba a escribir una conversación similar a la que estábamos escuchando, describiendo una ciudad. Puede ser San Salvador o otra ciudad que usted ha visitado. Ok. Eso sería para, para ahorita la actividad. No, 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 no. That's your homework. Ah, homework, ok. Homework. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Yes. Eh, in this moment, I'm going to take the attendance. Vamos a tomar la asistencia. So when I call your name, please say present. When I call your name, please say present. Adriana Gonzalez. Here. Thank you. Andrea Alvarez. Here. Okay. Carlos Valdez. I present teacher. Good. Cesar Alexander. Present teacher. All right. Christian Oswaldo. I'm here, teacher. Present. Gracias. Claudia Rivas. Present. Excellent. David Mejia. Present. Good job. Freddy Alvarez. Freddy Alvarez. Is absent, okay? Uh, Glendy Flores. Here. Excellent. Iris Martinez. Present teacher. All right. Irving Kimura. Irving Kimura. All right. Absent. Jonathan Salinas. Present. Excellent. Josue Portillo. Present. All right. Carla. Villanueva. Present. Thank you. Catherine Guatemala. Present. All right. Lisbeth Martinez. Present teacher. All right. Luisa Guerra. Present. Good. Luz Perez. Luz Perez. Upset. Myra Perez. I'm here. Thank you. Melissa Mendez. Melissa Mendez. Absent. Okay. Nerlin Flores. Nerlin Flores. Absent. Okay. Ricardo Diaz. Ricardo Diaz. Absent. Okay. Yancy Yamilet. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you. 
All right, thank you guys. Let's continue. All right, now for the next activity, what I would like for us to do is we're going to be looking at section number 1.4, knowledge check. Instructions. In this exercise, you are given some questions. In order to answer them, you need to choose the correct response. The best suits the question. Read all the information carefully. Instrucciones. En este ejercicio aparecerá, aparecen unas preguntas que para contestarlas deben escoger la respuesta que mejor se apegue a la pregunta. Lea cuidadosamente toda la información. So, you're going to read the question. What's SEO like? Is it an interesting place? And then identify the correct response. One, two, three, four, all the way to number four. Any questions? Any questions? No teacher. No teacher. All right. I would no, like teacher. for you to work in pairs to complete this activity. Vamos a trabajar en parejas para completar la actividad. Es un lugar, un lugar interesante, dice. Sí, se está haciendo la pregunta y nosotros uh -huh. tendríamos que encontrar el, el lugar, o sea, la, la respuesta correcta. Uh -huh. Quiero ver. Strong. El primero, quizá más. No, el, el segundo, quizá más. Creo que sí, el segundo. Uh -huh. Dice que es grande. Sí, pongamos el segundo. Yo el segundo. Creo, Yo creo sí. también que el segundo. Sí. Do you like your hometown? Why or why not? Oh, really? It's beautiful in Brooklyn. Ah, ya, ya, ya entendí un poco. Son las, las mismas los, respuestas, nos lo da en, los cuatro, en las cuatro preguntas y nosotros ah, tenemos yeah. que uh, en, pegarle uh, esa. Uh, para cada. Uh, ajá, están. Uh, están. Uh, sí. Para cada pregunta, y todo va a ser la misma respuesta. Sí. Él está preguntando si le gusta en los edificios, algo así. No, la, no. Es, es como. ¿Te gusta Sydney o algo así? Para ¿Do you like no. Hometown? Ah, no, ahorita oh, estamos oh. en la 2. Dice: ¿Do you like your.? Es demasiado pequeño. 
Sí, creo que es la Sería última. esa de las La respuestas. última. Ajá, no la le última. gusta. No le gusta porque quizás Y es la... pequeña. Ah, la número 3. Eh, what's in my life? I never been there. Yo creo que sería la primera porque este, le dice que hay, eh, que es muy limpia y que hay playas hermosas. Entonces, Sydney es... Y también Eh, le está haciendo una pregunta, uh, como Ajá. nunca estuvo ahí, dice, y le pregunta, oh, de verdad, sí que, ajá, uh -huh, creo que es. It's a beautiful and very clean and beautiful and beautiful beach. Yo creo que sería la primera. No sé si ustedes. Y la cuatro dice, have you ever been to Sao Paulo? Paulo. Estoy hablando de Brasil. No La segunda, quizás, que es la que, que. Yo creo que sería la segunda, Y también que la que dice, dice, que yes, cosas hay ahí. I have is. Yo creo que sería la segunda, pero no sé. Sí, yo también creo Démosle eso. ahí. Sí, ya. Si le doy a enviar, Ah, saben que sí está correcto. Uh -huh. sí. Esas Okay. serían entonces las respuestas. Sí. Y eh, contestó, las contestó Claudia. Uh, sí, la primera no he contestado porque entré tarde, no sé, no me, no me uní en un grupo. Sí. Ah. ah, ok. La primera. La La primera primera es la número tres. es. La número tres, ajá. Number three. Yes. Respuesta tres. Ah, ok. Muy Gracias. bien. Okay. La segunda es la cuatro, la respuesta cuatro, y la tercera es la primera respuesta, y la cuatro es la segunda respuesta. Ok. Ustedes terminaron la conversación anterior. Eh, sí, yo la estoy, eh, de hecho, aún estoy pasando la, el cuaderno, luego lo voy a pasar al, a donde dijo el teacher, que sería el apartado donde está la, antes del video de la conversación, donde, ah, del video, ajá. ajá yo también y usted Pero no la terminé toda, aún igual no la he no terminado. le no va a quedar de tarea Sí, dijo que era tarea. sí como es actividad de la plataforma Sí. All right, let's go ahead and check the activity. Let me have one volunteer do read the question and the response. One volunteer read the question and the response. Me? Hi, Myra. Uh, the first one. Yes, please. Number one. Okay. What so like? Is it an interesting place? The answer is yes, it's a, it has amazing shopping and the people are pretty friendly. Very good. Perfect, Myra. Myra, select somebody. Okay. Okay. 
Carlos Valdez. Carlos Valdez. Uh, do, do, do you like you Hampton? We or we not? No, really. It too small in here it's not really boring that i move anyway away very good repeat why 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 not why not excellent all right go okay. ahead select the next person for number three change cesar 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 Alexander. Uh, hi, uh, number three, what's Sydney like? I have never been there. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's amazing shopping and the, are people pretty friendly. And the people are pretty friendly. Very good. Thank you. Okay, the last one. Select somebody, Cesar, for the last one. David Alonso. David Alonso. Okay. Have you no. ever been to Sao Paulo? Yes, I have. And it's an extremely large and crowded place, but I love it. It has excellent restaurants. Awesome. Oh, what about this one? What's Sydney like? I've never been there. It's the first one. Oh, really? One. Oh, really? It's the first one. It's beautiful. Okay. Number four, teacher. There it is. There it is. That's okay. We got it. Oh, really? It's beautiful and very clean. It has a great harbor and beautiful beaches. Good job. Good job. Okay. Excellent. Any questions in regards to the exercise? No, teacher. Okay. No, teacher. All right. Let's move forward. And we're going to be looking at conjunctions. Listen to the video, please. Again. Can every this time we'll talk about conjunctions. We'll talk about and, Can but, everybody no, hear the video? However, yes, yes. Explanation, okay. we want you to practice. So please stay with us. Conjunctions. It's an exciting city and the weather is nice. It's a big city, but it's not too big. It's a big city. It's not too big, though. It's a big city. It's not too big, however. We use AND to connect two positive or two negative ideas. For example, the city is ugly and small. Canada is a big country and very clean. Notice there are two ideas in each sentence which are joined by the conjunction AND. Therefore, we can give more or extra information. Did you notice which punctuation goes before AND? That's right, a comma. Let's talk about the conjunction but. This one connects a positive idea with a negative one, and it goes in the middle of a sentence, and a comma goes before the conjunction as well. Follow me in these examples. The park is clean, but it is very small. The food is good, but it is very expensive. We have two conjunctions left, though and however. These two conjunctions are also used to connect a positive idea with a negative one, but they go at the end of the sentence. Take a look. It's a big city. It's not too crowded, though. He's really good looking. He's not nice, however. Can you write one sentence using though and another one using and? Do it in a discussion box. You may follow our examples as a guide. Hi, nice to see you again. This time we'll talk about conjunctions. 
we'll talk about and, but, though, and however. After the explanation, we want you to practice, so please stay with us. Conjunctions It's an exciting city, and the weather is nice. It's a big city, but it's not too big. It's a big city. It's not too big, though. It's a big city. It's not too big, however. We use AND to connect two positive or two negative ideas. For example, the city's ugly and small. Canada is a big country and very clean. Notice there are two ideas in each sentence which are joined by the conjunction AND. Therefore, we can give more or extra information. Did you notice which punctuation goes before AND? That's right, a comma. Let's talk about the conjunction BUT. This one connects a positive idea with a negative one, and it goes in the middle of a sentence, and a comma goes before the conjunction as well. Follow me in these examples. The park is clean, but it is very small. The food is good, but it is very expensive. We have two conjunctions left, though and however. These two conjunctions are also used to connect a positive idea with a negative one, but they go at the end of the sentence. Take a look. It's a big city. It's not too crowded, though. He's really good looking. He's not nice, however. Can you write one sentence using though and another one using and? Do it in our discussion box. You may follow our examples as a guide. All right, guys, I know that that's a lot of information. At this moment, do you have one question? Not for me, teacher. Not for me, teacher. Okay. Okay, guys, we're going to stop right here, and we will continue tomorrow. Please move forward, complete the exercises that you understand, and what you don't understand, you can ask me tomorrow in the class. Good night, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.